welcome, welcome, welcome. This is going to be for my little Saggies. Okay. This is going to be the rest of January. Okay. I'm going to tell you what you're looking at and then I'm going to pull you your best advice. Um, they are tearing apart the porch that's outside of my condo. So bear with the noise. I wanted to um, get this out for you. I didn't realize they were coming so close to my window right now. Okay. But. I got stuff to do when I wanted to bang these out, okay? So what's going on with my Saggies? You guys are dealing with the Pisces right now because I almost called you Pisces. It's either that or you're just, you're in that energy, Piscean energy. Saggies, Saggies, what's going on with my Saggies? My little hot tamales. Some of you are sitting in darkness, so it's time to step into the light. I think you need to learn patience right now. You got the Eight of Wands and you got the Two of Swords. Okay, so to me, this is a, a decision whether or not you're going to travel, send a message, move forward, mend something. I feel like you're screaming for help though. For some, others, you're super excited about what direction you're going in, but you're confused about where you're going because you're still trying to contemplate a decision, okay? So we got the Four of Swords, all right? So this is this is healing. This is a this is like a closed case. This is it's like the dead files. I don't know why I just thought about that, but it is like a closed case. But you don't want to open the casket back up, but you have to. You have to, okay? This is being guided at the bottom of the deck. You have La Santa Morte, okay? So this is this is a spiritual new start, and you got to make a decision whether or not to heal from the past, to, to let the past resurface or not, okay? Um, it's, it's not going to be an easy decision, but you have a brand new start, okay? Um, it is, it's change. It's, it's in the air. It's... It's new energy, but the energy you're feeling is a little tricky. But it's it's swift, it's fast, it's 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 going. Okay, something's about to to be resurrected. Okay, so let's find out what's about to be resurrected. Tell me about the four swords, four swords, four swords. This is a new adventure. If you choose it, okay, I, I wouldn't sit with it for too long, because the universe is waiting for you to take initiative in what it is you're doing. All right, it's the chariot. It's, it's just, it's moving forward, okay? So they're not even kind of telling me. So you must already know what this is because something's about to be resurrected. And the Wheel of Fortune, it's just, it's time. Yeah, this is unavoidable, okay? Whatever this is, you can't avoid it. You need to confront it. Do not wait too long. I'm going to try to clarify the Two of Swords. I don't think they're going to give it to me like that because they they didn't really give it to me. Unless they're talking about a Cancerian, you're going to resurrect something with a Cancerian, all right? Or it's your own energy going through, like, a resurrection, you know, a transition. But you need to go. You need to get on your path. Tell me about the Two of Swords, please. I don't know if you need to deliver a message. To me, that's just straight up, straight up travel. I'm sorry about that, guys. There's a lot of commotion. I feel like that's your life right now, though. I'm not going to lie to you. Tell me about the Two of Swords. All right, they're not going to tell me. You know, it's kind of like they didn't tell me the, what was going to be resurrected either. You know, so you obviously know what this is. But you need to stop putzing around. You got the Three of Pens here. This talks about you already planted the seeds. Are you going to nurture this or not? Whatever this is regarding, you must know what this is regarding because it's you making a decision whether or not to resurrect something from the past, something that was dead, coming back alive, moving forward, investing time in it, a new contract, going back to an, it could be you going back to an old job or an old lover or a, a friendship. It just depends, okay? Or it could be literally 
you, for some, and I know it's going to sound odd, but for some, they're... The autopsy came back inconclusive, and you're you're deciding whether or not to reopen the casket and 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 look for more evidence when it comes to something because the the family's now involved, and I think that's what's going to happen. So if that's the case, the casket is going to be reopened, okay? Um, and if you ask me, you they will find something, okay? And if you have to do that, I'm incredibly sorry. That, that's that got to be a hard decision. But for those who are not making that decision, whatever this is, is you got to get on your journey. You need to make a decision, but you're overthinking it because, well, sometimes it's okay to overthink, but I feel like you've been stuck here. I feel stuck, but they're not telling me. So you know what this is. There's no way you don't, my little saggies, okay? Something from the past is about to get resurrected. Best advice for my saggies. To me, it's, it's a, a, a marriage that failed coming back around too, possibly. All right, it's an unwise it's an unwise choice. Learn what you can from this situation. Review everyone's motives. So you really need to think here. So something you might be considering going back to an ex, a recent breakup, and they're saying, "Don't you dare! You better move forward. You better nail that casket shut. Don't you dare reopen it." Okay, so it can go either way. But you would know because, like I said, you know, the universe is telling me you know this situation. Then you got the Seven of Cups. It's a complex decision. You need to do some research. Stop procrastinating. You know, and underneath that is a tool of fire. You need to get on this journey, like I said. So it's either with or without this person. It's completely up to you. Okay, but they, they're saying you know what this is. If you need a divorce, get a divorce. If something needs to be nailed shut, you nail it shut. But stop procrastinating It's because you're procrastinating right now. See what I'm saying? See what I'm saying? It's time to keep moving. I love you guys. Bye.